guys, I'm Rianne Emerson and welcome to Pepper Bakes! Yay! So I got some comments from you guys on my last Pepper Bakes video where I baked some chocolate chip cookies and you really liked it. I got some really good feedback and you wanted my special guest back on here. So please welcome oh, my dad, Tom Emerson. Mm. What are we baking today? We are making a Cinnamon apple pie with raisins and crumb topping. Doesn't that look so good? Awesome. Oh, 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 Lord. <laughs> okay. Dad? Yeah. Can we continue with the video? Where's my assistant? This is not a one man job, you know? Okay, the crust. The one of the crust. You're using all the terms blend to moisture. So let's get all the dry ingredients first. Okay. Baking is a science. You can't just do whatever unless you. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. Is no, it? I'm talking. Oh. <laughs> I didn't know the camera. Never mind. You're even bad at me. Just. Come on, people. what I was saying. <laughs> Anymore. Did you wash your hands? No. <laughs> Extra flavor. We want that salty, dirty kind of flavor in our pie. You know, but that's just us. Okay, so the recipe calls for six Granny Smith apples, but we're going to use four Granny Smith apples and two red apples, just so it's not too tart, even though it's going to be sweet. <laughs> Oh. Damage the apples. <laughs> oh my god! Juggle your apples before cooking. It gets the the juices flowing. They don't bounce. <laughs> I screwed up. Anymore. That is peeling the apples. How very appealing. Mmm. And he's not laughing because that joke was terrible. <laughs> Turn around. Look at the camera. Say hi, everyone. Dad, chopping up the apples, we need eight cups. So we have to add a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar. It says, don't skip the teaspoon of vinegar in the pie dough. It helps to make the crust tender. So we're gonna do that. As much as I hate the smell of apple cider vinegar, mmm, sacrifices. You won't even taste it once it's in there anyway, so. I'm not doing that because it smells nasty. Oh, it smells so bad. We're a little bat, Dad. You gotta do this before the battery runs out. So we have to wait one hour for the dough to cool, and I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. So, I spy with my eye something with stars or whatever. Eight. Apples. No. Is it over here? Yeah. Is it edible? No. Here? Yes. This? No. Somewhere yes. here? Yes. This kind? Yes. Is it that appliance thing? <laughs> yeah. It's the adapter. That is 20 minutes late. He went downstairs to get some food. We were supposed to take out the dough. Oh, I'm go. They see me rolling, they hating, patrolling and trying to catch me riding dirty. Bubbling. Although it looks like a pile of dirt on top, it is very ooh crumbly on top. What do you think, Ariana? Mmm! Come on, Bob! Wow, that is really good! Wow! Crust is pretty good. It's 
it's really good. <laughs> Filling is amazing. It's so smooth and tangy and sweet. And crumble is perfect. It is crumbly. Oh, Bariana. I can't believe it. So guys, you have to try this recipe. I highly recommend it. Mm -hmm. Because it's so good. Probably one of the best desserts I've ever made. And all that time put into it was so worth it. So thanks dad for joining me again on another episode of Pepper Bakes because you have a fan base now. You have people commenting like, oh I think you have more fans than Dylan, which I don't think is true, but what do you have to say about that? More fan base than myself. Just wait when Dylan gets older. <laughs> he'll be he'll be the rock star. Okay. Thank you. So guys, thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, you should give it a awesome thumbs up. Also, you guys should leave a comment down below and leave some suggestions if you have any because I really look at them and I want to see what you guys want me to do videos about. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks guys, bye!